Hey, what's up YouTube? My name is Axel and today I want to share with you my favorite lens ever. It's the 85mm Canon 1.8. I've used this for literally everything. For over a year, it was the only lens I used for my portraits, for my weddings, for literally everything. So uh, let's jump into the video so I can tell you why you should get this lens in 2021. So I'm going to be honest, I can talk about the 85 mil for a very long time and I can come up with a lot of points on why you should buy it. But for this video, I'm only going to highlight two or three of those points and hopefully they're enough to convince you to buy the lens. It's changed the way I do photography, the way I do videos, the way I look at it, the way I edit. This lens has changed everything for me when it comes to photography and video. So point one, the 85 mil is 1.8. So basically that means the aperture goes very, very wide. And that highlights a few things. One, it lets more light in. So it lets you shoot when it's a little bit darker and this image looks crispy and not so much grain and distortion comes in. It also creates really crisp, good bokeh in your background and it helps isolate your background from your person and your talent. And it looks super professional and super clean right off rip. And that's really good for the price point of $350. I've shot with multiple lenses and this is the first one I see that shoots this well for under 800. Honestly, it's, I'm thinking of a lot of L series lenses that are over a thousand that kind of shoot in the quality that this lens shoots in. So the second point is that it's really light for what it does. Uh, it's around a little bit under a pound and I absolutely love it because for me, I have my big camera bag with a two or three lenses at a time, my camera body, my drone, my tripod, my Joby tripod, my microphone. It can get really heavy really quick, but this lens being so light, it lets me bring it without hating myself an hour or two or three hours later. So the last thing I wanna highlight about this lens is how versatile it is. Like I mentioned earlier, I've shot weddings, I've shot portrait sessions, I've shot, man, uh, baby showers, baby dedications. I've shot in church, I've shot indoor and outdoor events, um, races, I, I shot a 5K with this. The only thing is that sometimes you have to take a step back because it is a prime lens, but once you get used to it, it's not really that annoying. It helps when you think of how much equipment sometimes you have to bring and bringing four or five lenses when like sometimes I've shot weddings with just this one lens and the client loves it and it gets everything that I need where before I would have to bring two, three lenses to cover to be able to get some wide shots and be able to walk in and get some tight shots where this one lens basically covers everything for me. So there you go, YouTube. That's why you should get an 85 mil 1.8 lens right now. There's a link below. You can click it, buy it on Amazon. There's a Best Buy link as well, depending where you're at. Um, but yeah, you should get this lens, buy it right now. Tag me in your photos at axe.vasquez. I want to see your work. I want to see what you create. And thank you for everyone for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe and like the video. Comment below if you have any ideas. Do you shoot with the 85 mil? What's your favorite lens to shoot with? Let me know in the comments below. Love you guys. See you guys later. Peace.